Welcome to the Two Minute Entrepreneurship, where we use movies, shows, books, podcasts, businesses, and people to give you tips on how to be a better entrepreneur and sharpen your skills daily. Subscribe and like. New episodes every Monday through Friday. Do you know the story of American Express? American Express was founded during the same excitable westward expansion that spawned Western Union. After gold was discovered in California in 1848, droves of pioneer settlers headed west and relied on express riders. The Pony Express being the most famous. American Express, which operated between New York and the Midwest, started out as a delivery service for goods and valuables in 1850. Its founders, Henry Wells and William Fargo, split off to create Wells Fargo. Like Western Union, American Express has continuously reinvented itself over its history. In its early days, American Express's best customers were banks, which relied on American Express to shuttle stock certificates, notes, and even currency between remote branches. In 1882, American Express began offering its own financial product, the money order. The company issued the world's first traveler's checks in 1891. At the turn of the 20th century, American Express went global, opening offices across Europe. But the reinvention that made the biggest impact to American Express's bottom line was its entry into the charge card business. However, in the mid-1900s, American Express reinvented itself and what it was best known for by offering a charge card that extended credit to consumers and businesses. The very first American Express charge card was issued in 1958. The company added money orders and traveler's checks to its portfolio. It charged $6 per year for membership to its card, $1 more than its competitor, Diners Club, to establish itself as a prestige card.